How can someone not believe in fate? You know, there's millions of decisions that my ancestors from Lebanon and grandparents and parents from South Africa and me thus far in my life had to make that led me to you in St. Louis that night. The night that I thought was just any other night that changed my life forever. When I first met Joe, I remember thinking, this guy is really weird. He, he fits right in though. The funny thing, right, Joe, not always the most put together guy, kind of flies by the seat of his pants a little bit. <laughs> and I met Hannah and Hannah's like, seems pretty put together, you know? And then we get to Boise and we get in the car and we're in Hannah's car and there's a little daisy on the, uh, in the front of her car, like covering her speedometer. I was like, what? And I move it and there's every imaginable check engine. <laughs> and I'm like, oh my gosh, they're perfect together. Today, like it is like your day, and you are the bride, and you're still like running around, like making sure every like taking care of everyone else, and you're just like so selfless. You, you have such a big heart, and you're gorgeous. You are <laughs> like stunning. Now Joe's not one to brag, so I will. My brother is so exceptionally talented that there is an entire room of our parents' house dedicated, dedicated to his accomplishments. But the most admirable quality of that man over there is that he will always seek the trophies that matter, like meaningful relationships with people he loves. I was a mess. I fell apart. And I go to the ER and the doctors and the nurses are kind of trying to comfort me, right? Me. You have the kindest heart when you were just sweet and, and innocent and... I love you too. Two-year-old, broken leg, and they're trying to comfort me. And Hannah taps me on the head and says, It's okay, Daddy. It'll be all right. We went to the river to work on our speeches. I was sitting there and I was thinking about my life with Hannah. And I started to cry. And just then, I picture Hannah, my little girl next to me, taps me on the head. It'll be okay, Dad. Everything will be all right. And in that moment, I thought of Joe. And I said, it's going to be great. This is a great man. Loving, caring, compassionate, friendly. They are so great together. Aren't you close to me? Close to me. Close to me. Oh, close to me. Joe, of all the places that you have been in your life and all the people you have met, somehow you ended up here with me, and I feel so blessed to be marrying you today. I prayed my whole life that I would meet you, and here we are today with all our loved ones promising ourselves to each other forever. It took me by surprise, but I don't mind anymore. I'm wrestling with graceful boys and streaming just to hear your voice in the Joseph, I love you more today than yesterday, and less than tomorrow. I promise you my whole heart and that my love for you will never stop growing. You deserve the world, and I promise to always try my best to give it to you. I believe this life is full of endless possibilities that could have taken our lives both in endless directions. And although there's countless things I'm unsure of in this world, if there's one thing I know for sure is my heart would find its way back to yours in every single life in every single possible scenario. Close to me, close to me, close to me, oh close to me. What if I wonder, what if I missed it at
was blurry and your lips were red A perfect start into a perfect end Wish we never left, never left All I wanna do is live in slow motion Make it circles with you You can be the moon and I can be the ocean Baby, pull me back to you We go round and round and round and round again Feels like a movie that was black and white Hannah and Joe, you two are the true meaning of a power couple. Your personalities, interests, and talents align so perfectly. It's no wonder we're all here to celebrate the union of this special and unique relationship. All I want to do is live in slow motion, making circles with you. You can be the 